Good morning everybody. We are going to take a trip with my best friend. He asked me to come along with him. We're only going to Chicago and back, so I agreed on it. So we're going to be taking a little trip to a real yard. He's just going to drop that wagon and pick up another one. Then we'll be headed back to his house. So it's going to be a nice little afternoon to be doing our traveling. Wait, my trainer might be calling me. Fuck it. Enjoy your weekend, buddy. I ain't calling you this weekend. You ain't going out with me tomorrow. You know, you want to go tip a few beers back, go for it. Be ready Tuesday, noon. Between noon and five, somewhere in the I'll be out that way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You don't gotta worry about the butt crack of dawn on Tuesday. I won't be there then. Yeah. That's because I ain't getting up at the butt crack of dawn on Tuesday. Who likes to wake up early? Yeah. Oh, maybe me, but. Yeah, I don't mind. I like waking up early if I want to, not because I have to. Right. I don't like it when I have to get up at 5 a.m. because this truck needs to roll by 5.30 because I got a 7 a.m. appointment an hour and a half away from where I'm sitting. You know, That's like, right. Oh, I hate that. Sometimes it happens, though. Sometimes you're you're out of hours. Got to stop. You ten out, and boy, you got to push like hell. But it works that way. We are in the truck of James Smith, and we are on our way to Chicago right now. We are on a two-lane road cutting across the country to get to 196. If you all are from Michigan, Grand Rapids, Door area, it's a little shortcut. It's better than taking 331. That is 331, right? 131. 131. It's better than taking 131 and going south. Sorry for the shaking of the camera, y'all. <laughs> it's the road. We're going to take a blog today. We're going to get behind the scenes. We'll get regular conversations. And James is our navigator for today. We're going to wind up in a rail yard of Chicago. And we're going to make it a little education today. Um, if we can get away with it or however we got to do it. We'll have him show you how you pull a pin or maybe how you put a pin on or... How you hook a container up to a chassis? Absolutely, we can pre trip a chassis. Yeah. So it'll be a little education today if there are any JB Hunt drivers out there that want to be JB Hunt drivers, or if there are JB Hunt drivers out there that is subscribed to my channel, you guys can check this out. This guy is a trainer, he does it for a living, and. Uh, he teaches uh, the people how to do it the right way, not the wrong way. So if you you guys want to talk to Mr. Smith on this video, just go down into the description box and uh, I'll have a link to JB Hunt down there. So if you guys are planning on maybe becoming drivers, you guys can go on to the link and uh, maybe fill out an application. Absolutely. We're going to have us a good day. Let's do it to it. Go ahead. Oh, I say if uh, anybody wants to apply for a job with JB Hunt, uh, you can either do it over the website and put your application out, or if you want, you can stop any one of our drivers in a truck stop. We all have the people net of the Qualcomm on the truck, which has a macro in it, which is a job application. Cool. You can fill out your information right from any JB Hunt tractor. And it'll send off to our operations center and they will Which one is it? 
uh, James, which rural yard? Burlington Northern, Santa Fe, the Corwith Yard off Kedzie Wow. Look at all these trailers. Huh. All these trailers are going to end up on a train. Now see guys, this is new to me. Because I'm not intermodal. I'm OTR. I'm over the road. So this is all new to me. It looks more like a JB Hunt drop yard than it does a rail yard. Yes it does. Matter of fact, ain't the JB Hunt yard connected to this? At the back side of this is the JB Hunt terminal. <laughs> I don't get to do it unless the camera is on the dash. You know, I'm actually. Well, we are almost home. James is still driving. And we're on 131. And we are just about back to the house. I got a confession to make, y'all. I took a nap. <laughs> but he kept on driving. Anyway, I'll let you know when we're home.